and they're sent on their way. They're often racing for the Jockey Club and retraining of racehorses, veteran horse conditions race. And heading to the first, Mr. Pepperpot along the inside is one of the first ones to show. They're all over fence number one safely. Quickly now on to the second with Peacock Secret racing close up as well. So Mr. Pepperpot just ahead there to Peacock Secret who landed in second, racing in third, quite close at the moment. Wounded Warrior not too far off the pace with Shantu Tiger a little wider out on the track as they now come over the first in the home straight. And they're all over it safely enough, racing on now towards the next fence. This one coming up fairly quickly. Mr. Pepperpot over with the lead, all across it safely, a little bit slow, just back in behind the leading queue was Fairy Mix in a red coloured jacket, that one racing just ahead of five cards stud, and they're being chased through by Snow Castle as they come towards another plain fence, and watching them stream over, quite a well strung out field, they're all over it safely, uh, racing just up in behind five card stud as they go towards the next fence. His boats all see is a bit wider out on the track as at that fence there was a very bad mistake made by Manella Fair and Louise Till they're doing well to keep the partnership intact as they're about to make a right-handed turn out towards the far side. Roy Carno is right towards the back end of the field, so too at this stage pack it to the rafters. And as they make this right-handed turn, Royal Chant is another one in rear. So in the latest snow blizzard, they make the journey going away from us and towards a plain fence. Mr. Pepperpot over there to Peacock Secret in second. All across it safely. Quite close at the moment for third. A recovering Manella Fair down along the inside of Shantu Tiger, who's never been too far away. And now it's those two pushing forward from wider out. They come through to occupy the first two places. So Manella Fair from... Shantu Tiger, Mr. Pepperpot and Peacock Secret. They're around about three lengths ahead of Wounded Warrior as they are on the approach to the only fence going down the back straight. Not a great deal to separate the leading four whatsoever there. Snow Castle in green colours just back in behind the leading few. And then out wider on the track is Beau Sol C, another four lengths away then to Fairy Mix. So they continue their run over in the back. Roy Cardo is chasing Fairy Mix, half a length or so back. Another two away is five card stud. And then Royal Chant and Packet to the rafters. So now making the descent over on the far side of the track. Still a good long and a half or so before they reach their next playing fence. And up ahead it is Manella Fair who following that earlier jumping blemish has improved his position to go on with through along the inside Peacock Secret and then Mr. Pepperpot without a bit wider as they come over the next fence Shantu Tiger again just watching them stream over all landing safely pack it to the rafters was the back marker to touch down. Quickly on towards the fence which will be the last in a circuit and again on crossing it all landing safely enough in behind it very well stretched out peacock secret the red on the jacket towards the inside the darker colors of manella fair they are the leading two manella fair fractionally ahead that time mr pepperpot is in third men snow castle from shantu tiger and then roy carno as they come towards the next fence the one just before the winning line and on taking that, again, all landing safely enough. Five cards stud made a mistake at the back end of the field. Completely tailed off now is Packet to the rafters as they make the journey on up the hill towards the next plane fence, which will be followed by the open ditch. It's Manella Fair over that ahead, leading by around about a length over Peacock Secret in a second spot. And then Mr. Pepperpot and Wounded Warrior with a back in behind those Snow Castle, a little break then to the quietly ridden Roy Cardo as they cross an open ditch. Back in behind Roy Cardo on taking that is Royal Chant and then follows on taking that fence Fair Mix. Pulled up just before jumping that fence was Shantu Tiger who was prominent at an earlier stage of the race. Another one to call it a day at that point was Five Card Stud. As they now make the journey on out towards the back straight, Packet to the Rafters has also been pulled up and likewise Bose on C. So a few of them calling it a day. It's becoming hard work out there now as they come towards the next plane fence and it was Peacock Secret who landed ahead and clearly so that time. From in second place, Manella Fair. Wounded Warrior improving is into third. And they're being followed in fourth by Snow Castle under Joe Wright, who still appears to have a little bit to give with racing next on the outside, Roy Carno. That one continuing to catch the eye, traveling well. Mr. Pepperpot only one pace back in behind those now as they're racing towards the 
Fur Fence from home. Peacock Secret from Wounded Warrior and Manella Fair. Peacock Secret crosses that by two lengths there to Manella Fair and Wounded Warrior. Still Roy Cardo going well. He's up into fourth place. Now Snow Castle has come off the bridle. He's back in fifth. And these five are now well clear of Mr. Pepperpot Royal Chant and back in behind those fairy mix. So a long run now before they get to the second last fence. They're right across from us for the final time. And it is Peacock Secret who's been up with the pace throughout under Dale Peters. Of course, and Nari Dale was touched off in the previous race. Second place is Wounded Warrior. Then in third, Roy Cardo. Fourth is Manella Fair. Fifth is Snow Castle. And a very long break back to the others headed off by Mr. Pepperpot as they're heading right-handed and on the descent now down towards two from home. It is Peacock Secret who shows the way for a wounded warrior and the smooth-travelling Roy Cardo as they come to two out, Peacock Secret landed ahead. Not Roy Cardo's finest hour in the jumping stakes that time and now he's being shaken up. Wounded warrior towards the outside, they're a little way ahead of Manella Fair. Here's the final fence, Peacock Secret just in front but Roy Cardo now moves through in between horses. Wounded warrior around the outside and then six or seven lengths back to Manella Fair in fourth as they head for home. Wounded Warrior in the pink colours down the outside takes over narrowly now from Roy Cardo. Roy Cardo is now flat out. Peacock Secret is looking held in third. Racing into the closing stage as this is hard work. Wounded Warrior from Roy Cardo. Wounded Warrior in front and just seeing it out that bit too well for his second place Roy Cardo. Wounded Warrior beats Roy Cardo. He's back in third. Peacock Secret walking across the line and then Manella Fair and a break to the other. Yeah, yeah. Like the condition around with you.